and folks just relaxing. You know, we have even already saw areas of abject poverty. We have. You know, it's interesting though that there's very little litter lying around, very little trash. It's very, very clean. The streets are all clean. See folks out, kids out, lots of skateboarding going on, lively, colourful. Oh, <laughs> look at that little dog. Okay, so that's three dogs. Do you know, we've only, actually since we've got here, we've only saw one dog. Um, on YouTube videos we saw a lot more. It um, actually looked like there was dogs everywhere, but we haven't saw that at this area. And it's so, it's beautiful, look, you know, not a cloud in the sky. This is awesome for us because we're from Scotland and right now it's cold. In fact, the last couple of weeks we've had frost, we've had snow, so it's amazing to be here. <laughs> The birds here are beautiful and their song is exquisite, absolutely exquisite. When we woke up yesterday morning, our, our first day here, um, the song is just beautiful. It's more high pitched than the birds we are used to hearing in, in Scotland. And we've got actually managed to get up close to a few of them. And um, there's none here on the ground just now, but they look like little quail. That's right. Mm -hmm. And they are really pretty tame, kind of like pigeons in, the, in that you can get so close to them, but they're tiny and just lovely. We'll probably see some close up at some point. Now I can see the jacaranda trees on the outskirts there, so we'll try and get a little bit closer to them. This is Christian, he's a, a tourist guide and he wants to say a few words. Okay, uh, our tour includes a guide in English, Spanish, transportation and ticket. The cost per person for tour is the 500. We have tour to Pyramides, Xochimilco, Puebla and Tasco. Uh, you can find in dollar, you can find in cash, on card, wherever. Okay, have a nice day guys. Okay. And um, the, the places around here you mentioned to us? Uh, the visit of the tour, for example, the Pyramides, visit La Basilica de Guadalupe, mm -hmm. visit Home de la Cultura, Plaza de las Tres Culturas, and Pyramides de Mula and the Sun. The tour de Xochimilco includes the visit uh, one hour in the boat de Xochimilco. The boat? Yeah. The boat. In, include uh, visit the home de Frida Kahlo, the visit to the Estadio Azteca. Where... Okay, fantastic. Gracias. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, you. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Thank you, then. Thanks for that. Thank you. Look at the lovely bags. Look at those lovely bags. So we have found a lovely lady who speaks English. Say hello to Carmen. Hello. <laughs> Thank you, Carmen, for doing this little interview with us, and uh, it's very kind of you. This will be going on my YouTube video, so people around the world will, will see it, and especially people in the UK and people in America. And really just wanted to ask you, Carmen, what's it like to live in Mexico? Well, it's, you know, lovely. I love food. You know, food is very delicious. It's so spicy. And that's what I love the most about living here in the city. Uh, also, what I like to be here is there's a lot of people. You can meet lots of friends, you can go out here like in the park, go skating like I was doing just here. And the, you know, the weather is so lovely. Yeah, it's great. It's, it's absolutely sunny fantastic. sunny and it's warm and nice. I don't like when it's cold. Here it's like 
so nice. That's what I like most about the city. I don't like, you know, that it's noisy and that's a lot of pollution sometimes. And what else I don't like? I don't like sometimes that it's not so secure. And there are people who are loving or, you know, seeing what uh, you are doing, doing so they are following you and stuff. So. But that can happen yeah. anywhere. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Here it's like, so common to uh, Yeah, that's what it's like to live here in the city. Thank you very much. We, we found that um, so far we've only been here a, a couple of days, um, but as you say, the weather is beautiful. Um, back in Scotland, we are used to cold and rain. Yeah. And snow. And snow. I have a brother living in Ireland. Ah, oh, wow. yeah. And um, that's what he's complaining all the time. <laughs> yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure he does. Um, yeah, and as you were saying, you know, security and we've noticed that there's a lot of police around, which is which is lovely to see that. And you know, we were saying that can happen in any country, really. We we get that back home as well. You know, and it, like any country, there's safe places to visit, and there's places that are maybe not so safe to visit. So yeah. Um, but yeah, so far it's beautiful and the architecture yeah. is beautiful. Here, yeah. there is a church over there. It's like over 500 years old. Wow. It's lovely. I like to go there. So yeah. Wow. Maybe you can go visit. Yeah. yeah. We're going to go to the Palace of Arts as well this afternoon, hopefully as well. Go in there, and see, the, see the murals. Yeah. And um, we saw the post office. So, it's so old. It's so old, yeah. It's stunning, isn't it? Just beautiful. Yeah, the architecture. Yeah, it's amazing. Astonishing. <laughs> and um, yesterday we we had some food and boy, it was spicy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I love about it. Yeah. I, I was like, oh, too spicy for me, but my husband Paul, he loved it. <laughs> well, thank, thank you so you much, much, Carmen. And you're welcome. I'll tell you my YouTube channel and, and um, give you a shout out there and if you're on YouTube you can stop by and say hello and we'll come and <laughs> thank you so so much you've been very kind thank you thank you so much have a lovely time here thank you thank you bye bye Mexican hairless <laughs> Our first Mexican here was dog. Uh, so los Winkle dog. Uh, it's a native from here, from Mexico. Uh, it's a dog that the ancestors of this uh, land have, like uh, they have the thought that they were the brother of one of the gods of here. The, the name of that god was Quetzalcoatl and the god Xolo. That dog was his little brother. Right, okay. Muchas gracias. Hi guys, this is us back at the Palace of Art and at Alida Park and you can see the jacarandas are now in full bloom. So we're going to go to the park and have a little walk about. So here we are now just outside the Palace of Art. It's just before lunchtime. And you can see it's reasonably busy. So you guys can see this, all the lovely jacarandas in the full bloom. This is the last, second, start of the last week in March. And you can see we are in full bloom here. Concert on this week outside, that's a big sound stage for it. Hopefully, the camera's picking up the, the nice colours of the jacaranda leaves, flowers. So, here we are in the centre of Alameda Park looking up towards the Palace of Art. And you can see it's another 
may stay in Mexico City. Guys, that's us leaving uh, Alameda Park now and the Palace of Art on our last day in uh, Mexico City, our last day in Mexico, 2019.